Hello everyone, welcome to my second race ever with the Radical. We are at Okayama, let's have some fun. Green flag, green flag. I can't start to save my life with this car. I'm gonna lose a position right off the bat. That's okay. Let's have a nice clean race. I'm learning this car and I'm having a lot of fun doing it. Oh boy, it's such a different beast from what I'm used to. We got cold tires. Just a second to see if my mic's not muted. Yeah, so cold tires with this thing is a menace. Really want to be careful. As, da as Daniel in front of us kind of slides out, it's so easy to do that. Whew. It's fun to learn a new car every now and then, especially when it's so different from what you're used to. And break early. I can't break late right now with the tires being the way they are. Nice and easy. We got the draft, so it will keep us going in the straights. But in the corners, we'll lose some downforce. Gotta make up for that. This part is especially tricky. I like to take it in second gear. It feels a little more stable. I can carry a little more mid corner speed, but uh, it's so easy to lose the rear end on exit as well. Here, I'm just washing out like crazy. Okay, survived the first lap. Tar's a little bit better now, a little bit better. All right, let's see if I can get first back. Daniel is no slouch. Nobody here are slouch. is a slouch. These guys know what they're doing. Me, I'm still working on it. <laughs> I'm working on it. So yeah, the beautiful thing about this car is how good it is at teaching you throttle control, just power management. You can't slam on the power like I'm used to. That's actually a big part of my problem as a driver. Like the things that I'm working on as a driver, I'm very aggressive in my return to the throttle. And some cars just don't like it. No car should like it. I mean. You should always be smooth, but I'm not. I'm very aggressive, but this car is very good at teaching me not to do that because it does not comply when you try to do that. The rear end just snaps. It's such a short wheelbase. I need to focus for this corner. <laughs> oh, man. Got a good exit. I'm really weak on the final corner. I'm always losing time here, which is a shame because T1 is a great opportunity to overtake. Please, there you go, Dorian. Here as well, you want to start applying throttle before you reach the apex because it, it does give you some rotation. You need to, you know, wrap your head around it. It's very different. Very different. Hell of a lot of fun, though. Ooh, he's sliding around a little bit. I need to get one good exit here and I can make a move potentially. I'm, not, I'm in no rush. The warmer the tires, the easier that will be going offline, trying to... I'll break someone, stuff like that. Breaking early. Again, I'm drafting. I'm carrying a little bit more speed than he is. So I can't break exactly where he breaks. I'm focusing on my exit, which is keeping me nice and close to him. This sector is really nice. I really enjoy this part. And now, the business. U-turns. A lot of time to gain or lose here. By not carrying enough mid-corner mid speed, or too much, in fact. Really struggling with the high speed corners. Last couple of corners, just no bueno. Very hard on the draft. Daniel is doing really good work to stay in front of me. Very consistent. Very quick. So, this is a free combo. I really urge you guys to give it a go. As I've said, this is a great driving school. Everyone can jump in and see class, so I'm assuming most of you guys will be able to jump into this. Even if you're not going to race it, which is very tricky, by the way. 
racing it on cold tires the first couple laps not easy you want to get used to it before you jump in but oof I'm afraid of breaking late there looks like I have some sort of advantage on the hairpin uh, so the back straight is the best opportunity I got to make a move I need to stay close to him on this sector though I keep losing him here on high speed right handers super recommended combo give it a try boys Woo. and girls don't break too late here find the apex I missed it a little bit gonna wash me out uh, he's not too far he's not too far find the apex start to squeeze the throttle back in here is very tricky you want to break early find the apex with the power or just washes out Work on an exit here. Not good enough. Not close enough. I need to be in the 03, 02 range to maybe go for something. I'm gonna show my nose, start to apply a little bit of pressure. See if that does me any good. Going wide there a little bit. Don't want to put it in third here. Useless. Stay right on the limiter. Break early here. Try to carry the speed throughout the corner. It's very long, slow corner. You want to maintain your mid corner speed. Oh, it's a bit late on the brakes. A bit late, Dorian. That was bad. All right, I'll work my way to him again. Head down. See what I can do. Oh, he lost the rear end there a little bit. That's going to bring you right back to him. Not close enough. If I was closer, that could have been my my end. Could have made a move. Ooh, don't lose the rear end now. Don't put it in third. You just said do not put it in third and you're putting in third. No. <laughs> Nice and easy through this corner. Try to carry the speed. Let the car kind of over rotate a little bit, but don't steer too much. Really want to be very gentle with your steering here. Mm. Very tricky through the high speed corners. I'm just not enough grip to get a good exit. Okay, so I'm close again. Whew. Not hard. Uh, it's not easy, I mean. Very hard. Especially on the draft, but Daniel is also very fast. I needed everything I had to catch up to him. Now I'm in a good distance. Oh, going on the defensive. Break early. Try to get a good exit here and try to work for a good line on the exit here. Late apex. Get back on the power. Stay as close to him as he dare. Big lift. I don't want to wash out. Plenty of brakes and return early on the power. I'm close. I'm close. He's feeling me. Woo! Good racing. Show my nose a little bit. This is going to be tricky. Stay close, Dorian. Come on. I need him close to me on the back straight. I don't know. I don't know. Not close enough. He really nailed that exit. Throwing everything I have at him. He's holding it well. Oh, 
Oh shit. <laughs> Damn near lost the car. Try to break too late there. Shane. Shane, now I'm gonna have to work my way back to him. See if I can do that at all. You really want to manage the temperatures on the rear tires here. It's very, very tricky. You don't want to overdo it. Right, so I couldn't really get to him. We're on the final lap now. And, uh, yeah, I mean, I stuck with him. I got close a few times. It was back and forth quite a lot throughout the race. But he was <clears throat> too consistent. And I, I think I just wasn't fast enough. I need to get a little bit faster in this thing. Or maybe, for the very least, work on my starts, because if, if, I didn't, if I wouldn't have messed up my start, I still don't know how to launch this car. If I wouldn't have messed it up, that would have probably been a different story. We would have definitely had a proper battle instead of me just chasing him throughout the race. But yeah, I enjoyed it a lot. If you guys want to see more radical stuff, let me know, because uh, I'm, I'm having fun here. If you guys enjoyed it, if you did, leave a like, and if you want to see more, subscribe. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.